It's a lovely day here in West Sussex, and everyone's turned out for a very good cause, Chris. Andrew Seville benefit. Couldn't get much better, John. No, it's lovely, and all these players, Tangolas all, Cambiasso, Nachi Hege, Gonzalo Pires Jr. and Lola Castagnola, we're going to play for Jaeger Lacoud, are giving their services for nothing. And here we have Facundo Pires, the brother of Gonzalito, Bautista Egi, Miguel Luis Estrada and Marcos Egi um, for the Coom Wines team. And straight away, the number three for Coombe Wines, Miguel Luizio, looking for Facundo Pires. Three or four months younger than Cambiasso when he got to 10, Chris. Oh, it's, a, it's a big effort, isn't it? But just listen to the ground you were talking about earlier, John. Look, you can hear the horses running on it, how soft it is. Lolo, lovely pass. And here comes Gonzalito, isn't it? Yep. Gonzalito, he shouldn't miss this. He's out in front. Cambiasso taken out the defending player very, very unselfishly. Gives an easy setup there and put away with a plum one goal each. Easy peasy on this one, John. Look, the ball doesn't even bounce on these fields. This would be a pleasure for us to play on. And equality in one. Beautiful scenes here at Stenham. And we're going to start with a knock-in here in the second chucker. Marcos Hege made that amazing save. Brings it in, fires it out to the side. Looking for the number three. Oh, and that's a beautiful pass. For Gundo Pires, look at that, it's tennis. Overhead smash, dinks it up in the air, overhead smash. Picks it up in the air again. And now Lolo's hurrying. He thought he'd miss that. How can you think that this man's going to miss? That was magical stick work, Chris. Uh, we can all do that, John, but we just don't like to put the pressure on ourselves to, to be the best all the time. So we leave it for these guys. They love it. They love the attention. And just look at this. Up, all over the place. Down. Up. Down. In the air. Everywhere. Absolutely unreal. And I don't know. You can do it well, sometimes, especially well. with the bigger ball in the arena. But it's a 5B, two, Coom Wines in the white. One tap Marcos, long drive. Down the ground, this time Lolo's got everything under control. Not gonna get caught out. Tail back and a regulation out to the boards. Facundo Pires goes back with Nachi Hege. Fires it down to Bautista Hege. Bautista Hege, beautiful shot in for the corner. That can't be, that can't have gone in from there. But it did, wow. What about that, Chris? Well, I've got to see the replay, John, because it must have hit a divot and gone in because that doesn't happen all the time. I'm getting a bit sick and tired of watching this, John. It's putting me to shame. I can't see it hitting anything. It, you know, that, that was probably about nine inches, 12 inches of goal he could see. Well, we might as well give up. Yeah, three, three, one, three, one, two wines. And off they go again. Look, Bautista. I've had one that in. I've seen the other one ball juggling. I'm going to do my own bit. It's up in the air. It's down again. And thank you very much. Nachi Hege, he's been very quiet in this game, Chris. Oh, I think Miguel's been the quietest for me, John. He's not, he's not really pumping forwards with the aggression that the other boys are, so hopefully he's saving a few in the bank. Yeah, but you know, when you're on the winning team, you can have a bit of a rest. Nachi's oh, trading by three. And it could be four. What a long bomb that is from a long way out onto the end of a stick perfectly. And he's come up from the back to score one from the front. I thought that shot was going to go in from this long drive here. Look at that from Facundo. Beautiful, straight up. So the number one reads it perfectly. Who's supposed to be at the front. Fires a long ball from the back to the back. Who's supposed to be at the back. Who's at the front. Who just pops it in. Beautiful. Interchangeable 10 goal polo. Great to watch, and Coombe winds five. Jaeger Lakutra, one. Five goals to one here at the start of the third chucker. Coombe winds in control of the match. Carlos Cusida with his brother Memo in control of the umpiring department. Not been called on to do a lot, a couple of obvious ones. 
game being played in a good spirit, but very competitively, Chris. Yeah, yeah, it's very competitive, John. There's Bautista again. He's all over the place. Well, there's old Woo! tens, new tens, cousins, brothers against brother. Jager Kutra cannot be four goals down, so he puts the ball up to Gonzalito Pires. He looked for the perfect pass to Cambiasso, couldn't get it to him, and oh, look. Cheeky little oh. tail back, and that was beautiful. Look at that. Who was in there where? Who was at number one? That was Gonzalito Pires. He got the back end. Back in play after the half time break. Treading in, hardly necessary on this carpet of a sword. But they enjoyed themselves, had a good walk around, took the airs, chatted, met up with a few people, and now back to the main part of the business. And that's Yegi's come out on a grade, got the ball, picked it up, dribbled it round, dribbled it through everyone, calm as you like, another next shot, and suddenly we have a one goal game. Beautiful. That's Yegi with the backhand. Oh, Cambiasso. They all thought it was going to go open. Cambiasso called tail. Miguel Lovijo running back with Lolo Castagnola. Oh, who's going to win the horse race? Cambiasso just leaves it beautifully behind where Miguel was going to intercept it. Is this the equaliser? He's playing with him as a cat would play with a mouse. And finally, the coup de grace, the fatal blow from Cambiasso. Ties the scores at six apiece. Well, it's great to see him playing again, John. <laughs> he hasn't been uh, doing too much in the first three, Chuckers, so maybe the coach on the sideline has said to him, come on, boy, wake it up a bit, and let's make this more of a game, get it tied up, and he, here he goes. It's a game of two halves, could be his half. Oh, and Jäger yeah, Lekuch, they're just uh, dominating every phase of play at the moment. That's Jäger, takes off again. Looks up, there's somebody free here, or so he thinks. Oh, he loves that next shot. What a great shot. And Lolo come through from the back. Lolo Castagnola run past everybody and they're in the lead. Four unanswered goals in it, Chris. Unbelievable, seven. unbelievable. And straight away, Coombe Wines coming back. And straight away, Facundo. It's 8 7. Well, they just let them catch up, Chris. They say, it, they say it's all won and lost in the lineouts. Is that true, John? It is, Chris. If you lose more than you win, you're likely to lose the game. At this level, yeah? Oh, absolutely, because they don't miss. And nor did he for Kundo Pires. And at the end of the fourth chucker, from having been a goal down, Coombe Wines lead eight goals to seven. And straight on with the fifth chucker. It's Jäger de Kutra trying to address the little matter of the one goal they're losing by. Gonzalito Pires plays with Marcus Hege. Marcus Hege gets back, rides him off shoulder to shoulder. That was perfectly fair. And there's a bit of a melee. And who comes out of it? Adolfito Cambiasso comes out of it. Coom nine, Jäger de Kutra eight. Chucker number five. Facundo. Oh, the show and tell, the give and go. Ah, oh, look. <laughs> he said to Lolo, do you want a little bit? Do you want a little bit? No, you can't have it. Not he went. He's seen enough. He's seen enough. Off he goes. One back, one back, one back. Caught in traffic. There's two in front of him, two behind him. Uh, oh, yeah, there's another one. And from the side, Nachi off the stick of Miguel. That's the first time it stuck Miguel's stick for a while, and I think it was an in off. So it's game on now. And the Blacks on the attack. Camiasso up two. Gonzalito, Gonzalito, next shot from way out. Going, going, going. It's out of here. It's out of here. Yegel Kutra into the lead, 11-10. You see how he winds up for this next shot, John. His hands above his head, the sticks in front of his nose. Look at this. What's this? He's got to get some wood on this. He wants to get some distance. You see the Ooh. angle of the stick? Oof. He does. He creates some great angles. He unwinds them with power and precision. And he puts his team one goal in the lead. Nachiegi, he says, let's go. We can win this one. Let's get away. Let's put some distance. Picks up a bouncing ball once, twice. It's misses in front the of you. Marcos Egi does not like what's going on at all. He's called for the ball by Miguel. Miguel in on the line. No whistle. 
no whistle. Nachi, Nachi the Haggy scores and Yegi Lakutra, two goals in the lead. This is the most improbable outcome for us. And as the hooter goes, Gonzalito Pires races onto the pass, but it's needless, it's all over. There's Adolfo Cambiasso, Yegi Lakutra have won this game by the narrowest of margins, Chris. It's a fantastic game to watch, Tony. It's just a different level looking at this 40-goal level, isn't it? And Jaeger and Kutra have won for their sponsor 12 goals to Kuhn Wines 11.